Jen giggled and continued her story. So anyway, one day a cute male came into the store and bought a bunch of food and a package of pampers, I didn't see it the first time he came in, as I was pretending to be, and I just thought he was cute. A week later, he came in again, he bought some home supplies, and again a package of pampers. This time I saw it, they were not the same package style that I saw when I first bought my own diapers, but they were clearly not what Earl had in stock for real. After working at the store for a few months and helping with inventory, I found my theory about the shelf to be correct, it seemed that the shelf had instilled magic into the diapers. Whenever Earl ordered a new supply of pampers, they would come in as the current style. As soon as I put them on the shelf, they turned into what I wanted them to be, old-style baby dry with plastic backing. Michelle giggled again. That's what I see too, she added. Oh I know, said Jen, it's amazing, she added. Jen continued. So as I said, eventually I realized that I could sometimes see what others would see if they were attracted to diapers for one reason or another. For example, if they were purchasing them for fun. Jen smiled at Michelle. 